My name is Jane. My name is Hashlandi. And, and this, this is, is what, what the Lord, Lord has done, done for me. me. Um, he brought us here to GYC completely unexpected. We were just having our vacation at UT Pines. Mm -hmm. And um, one day we were talking about GYC and he just kind of opened the way so that our ticket was just five dollars about for each of us. And then we got to um, get free lodging and a free food um, from a, a friend, a friend of a friend, mm -hmm. and, um, and just paying our registration. And by the time we came here, um, we we were so blessed mm. by the sacrifice of the family that took us in. I remember one morning coming down the stairs and I saw each member of the family just sleeping on the couches and on the floors and I was just blown away by the sacrifice that they were willing to sacrifice their own rooms and comforts right. um, and enter into our own sufferings and then it was today that I realized just like Jesus going into the homes of different people, I too, we too entered into his sufferings by um, accepting and going into their homes and accepting their foods and their hospitality. Um, just really humbling experience and I'm very, very grateful that God has shown us um, examples of giving and hospitality. Right, and also adding to Jane's um, testimony, which is ours, um, kind of, it wasn't just us that the family took in, there were others as well who got to experience those blessings um, from the family God used to help us yes. um, in such a time. The other great thing that God showed me during this um, trip was that He really listens and cares even about the little things. I saw in the newscast that Portland was a very cloudy place and it would be raining at least three times in the week. And I had asked God if He would make it sunny at least for two days um, during the time that we're here, one including on Sabbath. And this was even before we got um, here. And then on the, I think what day we went hiking, um, that morning, Tuesday. on Tuesday, I looked out the window in that morning and um, I saw the sun. And then the rest of the days were cloudy and rainy, cloudy and rainy. And the Sabbath, I really wanted him to bring out the sun again. And, um, but I asked specifically that it wouldn't be while we were in service. And um, we came out after lunch and still cloudy. And then we decided, okay, let's just go outside anyways. And when we came outside, the sun was shining. We sat on the building. We walked around the building and we just, it was all glorious. And just like, Amen. God. <laughs> He loved me. I, I was just so thankful that he gave that little token that he, he is watching and he cares and he will answer our prayers according to his wishes. So the testimony that I would like to share is how upon arriving here, Jane and I, we really wanted to be a blessing and we saw that we could be used in the capacity of singing in a choir. Mm -hmm. However, the deadline to be registered to volunteer as a singer <laughs> singer was actually December 8th. And we still were persistent and we prayed about it and we registered. And for the first meeting, we did show up and no one asked us anything about, you know, like, did you? Um, ladies register or not and we had no issues there and we were able to join all of the meetings and it was truly a blessing and just the director the those who were singing with us it was just a, just a beautiful experience and to see the finished um, product today um, Sabbath it was just such a blessing and it really melted my heart